Morning everyone, I'm Jim Donovan with your morning digital news brief for Thursday, October 17th. Philadelphia detectives say a man armed with a meat cleaver attacked another passenger on a SEPTA bus. This happened around 2.30 this morning in Spring Garden. The victim was taken to Jefferson University Hospital with injuries to his head and hand. The attacker, a 45-year-old man, was arrested. Detectives say the men did not know each other. Both presidential candidates continue to focus on Pennsylvania. Former President Donald Trump will be in the Philadelphia area this Sunday. His campaign says he plans to work behind the counter at a local McDonald's. Vice President Harris will return to the Delaware Valley next week. And you ex can experience fall on the farm without leaving Philadelphia happening today. Dilworth Park transforms into a hay maze. We checked out Center City District's maze days overnight. Fun activities include children's story time, pumpkin carving, and fresh apple cider making. Adults can also enjoy themed happy hours in the seasonal beer garden maze days opens to the public at 11 today and runs through October 27th. Let's get a check of the next weather forecast. Here's meteorologist Kate Bila. Morning, Kate. Good morning, Jim. Well, great weather into the weekend for any of those fall activities you want to enjoy. We've got a bit of a chilly day today, though. Temperatures still slightly below average. We've got some clouds down the shore. There's a system lurking just out to sea, but Unfortunately, that's not going to bring us any much needed rain. All that moves farther away and we will be sunny for most of the area for most of the day. Just more cloud cover across parts of South Jersey closest to the coast. Otherwise, bright sunshine in Philadelphia still chilly, though the high just 61 degrees. Our next weather story, though, goes the other way. It's a huge warm up. We're back to 70 by tomorrow, warming each day through the weekend and into next week when we could possibly hit a near record high of 80 by Tuesday. So your next 10 days showing that quick warming trend here from today into tomorrow and then right into next week. We'll drop back a bit Thursday into Friday of next week. That's also our next chance for a shower, although it looks pretty far, few and far between at this point. Your weekend forecast is beautiful temperatures in the 70s with sunshine both days. And again, we do need the rain, but there is none of it in this seven day forecast. Nothing but sunshine right through the middle of next week. Jim, back over to you. Thank you, Kate. And remember, you can always get Kate's most up to date forecast and the latest stories right here on CBSPhiladelphia.com. That's the latest for the morning digital brief. I'm Jim Donovan. Make it a great day.